Comey FBI Director James Comey in May 2017. And before Rosenstein appointed Robert Mueller to lead the Russia investigation. A group of European lawmakers have returned to Madrid after they were barred from entering Venezuela. Five conservative MPs had been invited by the opposition leader Juan Guaido, but they were detained at the airport in Caracas. Guaido is seeking to pressure the regime of Nicolas Maduro to allow international humanitarian aid into the country. But Maduro supporters called the visit a right-wing plot to try to overthrow the government. More Julia reports. A delegation of five European MPs, all members of the conservative European People's Party, tried to enter Venezuela, but never made it past Caracas airport. We did not go as tourists. We did not want to create any problems or to provoke. We were responding as members of the European Parliament on an institutional level to an official invitation to have a working meeting with the president of the National Assembly, who's also the interim president of the country. Venezuela's foreign minister said the lawmakers had been advised several days ago they would not be allowed entry. He said the country could not permit the European extreme right to disturb the peace and stability. The MPs were invited by Juan Guaido, the leader of the country's National Assembly who proclaimed himself president last month and now has support from 50 countries, including many in the EU, who trust him to organize a new presidential election. For us, the democratic transition in Venezuela is to be carried out by Mr. Guaido because he has the legitimacy today to organize this presidential election. In the same spirit, we strongly condemn the conditions in which were expelled five European MPs who had come to inquire about the democratic process in Venezuela. Some of the strongest support to Juan Guaido has come from the U.S., whose air force have been delivering humanitarian